Yep. I'm still thinking it's the dog. What the heck are you doing, Kai? Yeah, what happened to Ray? <laughs> oh, that that's why they were up there. I forgot about that. What mystery? Of the murder weapon? Okay, there's several mysteries, Edgeworth. Be more specific. Yeah. So I guess maybe we should head to the... Detention center? Or I guess the detention cells? Is that what you're gonna call them? Eh, we'll meet up with them. Maybe he'll find something useful. Yeah, so let's head into the cells then. See if we can find anything useful in there. Who is talking? Oh, it's Roland. <laughs> What? Wait, wait, what? The only assassin here I could think of is Dogen right now. I mean, you're talking pretty loud. Invite them? I would never let that dude out of his cell. Especially with the dog. So that leaves into the offices. See, this was the thing I was thinking. The only idea I could have is that you go up through the detention center, through the offices, through whatever that is in the center, and to the prison, but I don't know how the heck you get from the prison to the workroom. That's the courtyard? Okay. Okay then, I got it. And plus, you still have to go through Roland's office, which good luck getting through the warden with a dead body. Nah, I'd rather not. Alley? So you're saying it's not the weird ferret thing on your neck? She just sidesteps the questions. Okay. So this is his cell? Okay, and what day is it now? Okay then. And the first thing I'm gonna do is check the bed. Cause that's the only thing I can think of. Um... See his jacket? There's a bunch of dust on the floor. I can examine it. It's really dusty. It just looks like dust. Like, there's just dust there and, like, someone wiped it off. It's not just footprints either, so... Someone must have intentionally wiped it off. The sniff paper's ripped, too. Is that what they may have used to clean up, then? Yeah. Yeah, but why would... First off, what the heck was Knightly? If it... Okay, so obviously it's not a guard, because they would have just gotten a rag. 
So what the heck was Knightley trying to clean up? <laughs> Please don't. Um, let's connect those two things together. Torn newspaper and floor? It's the only idea I have. Okay, we're good. We're safe. Why specifically grape juice? The newspaper. There's no other reason anyone would bother tearing it up. There's nothing else you can do with it. Okay, then. What wouldn't he have wanted the guards to see, though? Like, at this point, why does it matter? Um, I guess we'll check the table next. This is a very fancy menu. Um... <laughs> There's a book that says... The Great Escape in 80 Days. Prison Life for Dummies. Um... The Hound Whisperer. The Warden's Curse. <laughs> Huh, I never noticed how much detail they put into those. <laughs> they seem like pretty good meals, though. Guys, see some kind of sushi or fish in there? I guess that makes sense. <laughs> Why should I have come up with excuses? Um, what is this piece of paper? Is this? Was N Nightly the person playing with it? Playing with Dogen? Okay, let me... I mean, if the place... If they're all in the same places... It's three pawns of Rook and a King. Three pawns of Rook and a King. Black Rook. Oh, okay, not the dog. Um, I think I see what I have to deduce. Yeah. So, I mean, all these different things you can say are like... Well, here's the other thing. That's just the movie mate. Yeah, so that's just the movie mate then. So let's... I'm gonna think I'm gonna deduce the exact spot where the... Dog is? Or I guess night. Um... Then just present this. Yeah, it's the exact same correspondence chess Dor Dogen was playing with. There, that's not that big of a deal. The weird thing is, is that there's one piece that's missing. Except for one. Which is why I'm confused. Why would Dogen put that there, but not put it on the memo? He had to have been. Well, okay, he has a connection to the victim. With chess. Like, seriously guys, come on, it's chess. That's barely a connection. 
Um, I don't think those books are going to be any important, so let's, let's see what's over here. Oh, so this is this is his sink, basically? Yeah. Yeah, I saw the security camera. Re record it. Find anything... Because we know he had to have come out of his cell at some point. It's just a question of, did he return to his cell, or if he was killed in his cell? Either of those would be really useful. What's going on? What's terrible? What did it record? Show me! Show me now! What do we have? There's Nightly. Whoa! Wait, wait, wait. Is that... Is that Anubis? It was here. I don't know which cell it is. Uh, so I'll just say this holding cell. Hmm. Yeah, but how the heck did Dogen's dog get into here? That's the part I'm confused by. Which piece of evidence takes a whole new meaning? Oh, the, 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 yeah, the wiped floor. Because then that would be the blood. Yeah. Okay, then. Thank you very much. <laughs> Fine gumshoe. What's the message? Yeah, luminol. Or whatever the heck it's called. <laughs> I don't know its official name. Eh, not completely. Yeah. So, I guess maybe we should go interrogate Dogen now? I, d I don't know. What are you screaming at? Hey! Why are you here? <laughs> Why are you here, Lang? Are you here because of Nightly? Shi Long Lang. The Atagarasu. I'm gonna guess Nightly. Why do you say it like that? Yeah, but I think Sheena slash Castillo you kinda creeped him out. That's what I'm guessing, that's the only reason he would be here. Yeah. It's the security the security guards end up killing each other. That's not really what you want. Yeah, he usually brings, like, a full army with him. What happened to them? At least he's cool about it. Okay, then. See you, Mr. Lang.
What are these guards going to know? I mean, I guess... Are you... Why are you troubled by this case? <laughs> uh, I think it's just... I think it's just the gumshoe... I'm, that's what I'm gonna call it. I'm gonna call stupid authority cops detectives the gumshoe syndrome. <laughs> Why do I need that in my evidence? Unless this has some kind of relevance to the plot. Hello, other sir. Yeah, like, how the heck did Dokken's dog get in here? So they didn't see Anubis come in. Ray? Hey, Ray! What were you doing? Talking to Simon, probably? <laughs> What's the new information? Come on. Come on, Ray. Shower me with information. An incident? What happened? Don't tell me he had something in the stupid chess case. Well, there had to have been at least a second guard. The key? Why? What? I'm confused. I mean, maybe that explains the stolen... uniform. But what the heck happened to the key, then? Huh. Interesting, then. What was that? It's you! Oh my gosh. <laughs> it's the best. Hey, buddy. You're not my buddy. I don't know why I said that. Probably. I think he's is like surprised. I love how like his little tail is um like a question mark and then like an exclamation point. Like just Metal Gear just blung. <laughs> that seems like something that could give you a good uh bruise on your head, whatever the heck you want to call it, bump. <laughs> Deal with it. We're pro bono. <laughs> then how the heck does... How the heck does Ray get by in life? He needs some some kind of business. No, I don't care about you, the best. Oh my gosh. I kind of want to punch this guy in the face right now. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh, this dude's an idiot. 